So today on Ask Live Strong, we're talking about the ruling that struck down gene patents. And I'm here with Dr. Adam Clark, and he is going to talk about uh, two questions that we received from our audience. The first one is, does this help or hinder innovation? And the second is, how would this affect targeted therapies? So Dr. Clark, can you handle the first question about helping or hindering innovation? C certainly, and, th and this is coming up in quite a few circles. Um, within patent law, there, there's always the saying, only God creates from scratch. So as we entered the world of biology, you really have to weigh what is really coming uh, from nature and what is actually the intellectual property uh, that's going to improve upon this. Uh, the court ruling deals with the isolation of a single gene and whether or not that is actually patentable. And this ruling said that no, the techniques for isolation do not justify um, this gene as a patentable uh, product. By releasing this, um, it's actually going to improve innovation down the road. Uh, scientists and groups will not be able to hold the information contained in a gene so that more researchers can't do research uh, on, on this. So we're going to open up uh, the chest of 23,000 genes to allow new tests to be done, perhaps uh, different panels of genes to be put together um, to develop new diagnostic mar markers or prognostic markers for treatments. And how will this affect uh, targeted therapies? We, we hear a lot mm -hmm. about the, the new upcoming targeted therapies. Um, how will this affect that? Well, personalized medicine is really uh, coming into maturity right now. And this uh, whole new field relies upon our ability to pair a diagnostic test with a treatment. So as we look down the road at um, different genes that may indicate an increased risk uh, for developing a type of cancer or may show us treatment A is going to be better than treatment B for a particular patient, uh, we're going to really revolutionize care. Uh, so this ruling will have uh, impacts moving down the road whereby researchers are really going to innovate to show that their treatment matches um, a response associated with the gene. Okay, well thanks a lot, and if you have any other questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks a lot.